All right, which one of you that are commenting in my upload post, in my community post, wanting to see me playing this game, Botany Manor? Hmm? Please raise your hand because today I am so happy to announce that we are going to play this Botany Manor game. And it's all thanks to the developer of the game, Balloon Studios, and the publisher, White Thorn Games. I'm so happy. Thank you so much for providing me with the opportunity to cover this game. And I'm also happy to show this game to you guys because I saw your comments. I saw that you want me to cover this game so welcome to the botany manor and please mind that this is not my manor so you guys better behave while we are inside there but before we go before we jump into the game there is one thing that i want to show you guys i was tinkering with the option and i noticed that they have a lot of accessibility feature here look look they have crosshair they have walking acceleration camera transition you can even toggle if you want to sprint or zoom and i love this kind of accessibility thank you so much because i am one of those people that are being helped by this kind of accessibility feature also they have they have this setting they have the motion sickness feature and if you read this botany manor is a first person game which may cause some people motion sickness yeah you can also translate that which may cause a certain vampire motion sickness and they have given me the settings needed just in case i might have motion sickness thank you so much developer you are so kind and understanding i'm so happy with this setting and yes i will just let these settings be on the default for now i haven't touched the game okay this is my first time jumping into the game as much as you guys so if I have motion sickness, I will try to customize the game from here, from this setting. But we will just leave it on the default for now. And let's go! And yes, I'm using my controller, the feature controller. I'm so happy. Goodbye keyboard and mouse. <laughs> let's go! Okay, Botany Manor, here we come. Knock knock! Okay. Behave, guys. Okay, be go, go. Shush, shush. mouse, please go away. All right, you better behave, guys. Better behave. No breaking anything, no touching anything, no burning anything, no destroying anything. All right. Ooh, they have a very amazing loading screen. I love that. <laughs> mm hmm Ooh, 1890. Which one of you that are born on that year? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Welcome to the Botany Manor. You guys better behave, okay? Do not touch anything. Do not break anything. Do not burn anything, alright? I'm your guide. I'm your caretaker. Don't you guys touch anything, alright? And yeah, L for walk, R for look. Yes. Oh my god. I hope I don't have motion sickness for this because this game is amazing. It looks so amazing. Can I kiss the floor? Can I kiss the floor? <laughs> can, can I inspect the floor? Oh my god. It's filled with dust but it's also amazingly beautiful. I don't know how to describe that. Okay, you fair dust and beautiful, beautifully dusted. Yes. Alright, let me walk a little bit, a little bit, slowly, slowly. We have a motion sickness person in the house, so we have to be really careful. Ouch, I got hurt by the cactus. Okay. Can I bring anything with me? Any cactus? No? And where's the thorn? 
What is a cactus without a thorn? That is not a cactus, it's a cactus. You take away the T because the T in cactus is thorn. Can I climb the stairs? No? Oh, alright. There is something glowing here. Let's read that. Excuse me, lady, lady, lady who? Lady who? Okay. Lady Arabella. Alright, letter from Groundskeeper. We're so happy to have you back at Botany Manor. I hope you had a lovely trip. I'm so happy to be here. Thank you. In your absence, I'm afraid some things in the manor have deteriorated. Though I can assure you, we tried our best to keep things in order. I hope it doesn't affect your research too much today, Bennett. Hi, Bennett! Thank you for the kind letter and for the information that the manor have deteriorated, have been destroyed, so I don't need to be afraid that I might destroy it myself. Let me collect that parcel. Mm -hmm. Arabella Green, Botany Manor, Somerset. What is inside? Oh, that's a cool looking book. Forgotten Flora. A herbarium by Arabella Green. Alright, open up. Oh, it looks so cool. It looks like a real book. Mayflower Publishing House. Established in 1840 and set in London. Dear Arabella Green, Thank you once again for submitting your book proposal, Forgotten Flora. Please send this empty herbarium back to us once you have completed your research and we will be in touch with a potential offer. Sincerely, Mayflower Publishing House. Ah! So we are about to publish our book. And can you smell that in the air? The smell of money coming from the book royalty? Mm-hmm. Can I? Oh my god, I can flip. I can flip that up! I like that. <laughs> okay. And index. Map. Map. Uh, huh? Nothing in the... Oh, so I have to feel this book. I understand. So we have to explore each part of the mansion, the manor. And we have to draw the map ourselves as we go, as we explore the manor. I see. And yep, pretty empty. Ooh, wait, how many chapter do we have? Excuse me. Five chapter. Alright, a fresh start, survivors of adversity, peculiar paddles, botanical allies, and climbing up. I like that. That's cute. Alright. So we should get out from this cactus house, I think. Alright, goodbye cactus. I might be coming back later on or I might not be. Let's just get on with our life. Knock, knock. Ooh, a fresh start. It is fresh indeed. So many plants around us. So of course it's fresh and dusty. I think it still feels with dust in my opinion. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Wait. Potting instructions. Oh no. I am bad at this. Please pot on saucer. Mm-hmm. Let me let me do that one by one. Wait, you are already on the saucer, right? Yeah, yeah. You are already on the saucer. Mm, oh, I can inspect that. Oh, alright. And what should I do? Add soil to pot. Add soil to pot. Alright. Add soil, add soil, add scoop soil. Mm-hmm. And what should I do next? Plant a seed. Alright, this seed. Yeah, this seed right here. What is that seed? Windmill word. Ah, that looks so cute. <laughs> Anemon, Anemon Februa. I hope I say the plant's name right. I want to grow the windmill word to filter the smoggy air in my conservatory. Oh, it's not dusty. It's foggy. I see. 
but I will need to research its temperature requirement first. Ah, and this is the clue that we have to fill in for the plan. This is really cool! Oh my god. Thank you for those of you who have been like commenting on my post on that I should play this game. I can see why you guys are excited to play this game. I'm excited too now. Yeah, yeah, let's go! And let me take this one, yeah? Windmill word. Yeah, windmill word. And then water the plant. Alright, water that one. Mm hmm It's growing, and then what I should do? Is there anything on the back? No. If there is anything on the back, even like just a slightest bit of horror, I'm running away from this place, okay? I'm yeeting myself out of the manor. Alright, and then what I should do? What should I do? What should I do? Let me check everything. Hello? Windmill word. Oh, you have friends! Windmill word is a volcanic flower. Volcanic means like... Alright, there is another settings here. Oh, for Mediterranean wildflower. Wait. Mm-hmm. Important clues get added to the herbarium where you can assign them to plants. If you are stuck, tracking clues can help you organize and validate your research. That sounds like the perfect text suggestion advice for Moi. Thank you! <laughs> Alright. So, wildflowers. Is that how it is? At the clue. And this one as well. There are several temperature that we can set our volcanic flowers, our windmill word to it. 50 degree, 45 degree, 50 degree, 60 degree. Hmm. But we are in England. We are in London, right? We are in UK right now. So what should I do with that? Open the book, the magic book. Mm-hmm. Temperature chart. And is there any clue around that I can check? Are you the temperature? Oh, you are the temperature. Let me set to 50. Will you grow now? Inspect. Okay, what should... Where should I put this? Where should I put this? Should I put this inside the greenhouse? This is a greenhouse, right? Excuse me! Excuse me, is this the greenhouse? You don't look green, but you should be a greenhouse. Okay, let me just put you back there because I still don't understand what to do. Wait, should I put a compost in there? No, they don't say to put, to put a compost there. Alright, I already set it to 50. And then what I should do? Wait, there is another thing in here. Somerset falls victim to industrial smog. Ah, this fog comes from the factory. I can barely see. Horse best drivers refuse to work in this condition. So I think our experiment can help with this problem. With this industrial smog. Yeah, I can also barely see myself as well. Turn around. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Dearest Arabella, on my hike, I came across the windmill word. Oh my god, there is a backstory to the flower. Like, how can we come into a possession of this seed? And that is so wholesome. A flower that only grows in Sicily? Sicily, yeah. Some locals told me the flower has air purifying qualities. But due to its bespoke temperature requirements, the plant rarely blooms. Maybe the flower could help with the smoke pollution in your conservatory. Thank you so much, Marion. I am in need of that. So, open heat fan. Oh, oh, I should put you there. Come here. Windmill word, come here. Come here. Let me put you there. Time to feel the heat. Mm-hmm. Is that alright? Ooh, alright. Feel the heat. Is that alright? Is that all? Huh? 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 
Wait, why are you dying? Why are you dying? Why are you dying? Herbarium? No? Let me check. Let me try to go to 45. Yeah, 45. Let's go. Experiment. Mm -hmm. Feel the heat? Do you like it? Why are you growing back in? Why are you so shy at me? Why are you growing back in? Oh, I can't go there. That, that is so scary. I'm not going there. <laughs> that is scary. Okay, too much fog. I can't see anything over there. And what should I do next? Maybe 60? Maybe 60? Okay, let's go with the 60. Okay, feel that? Oh, we found our perfect heat. All right. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. Wait, wait, wait. I want to take a screenshot. I want to take a screenshot. All right. Mm hmm. Ah, screenshot it. All right. Oh, it looks so beautiful. And I love the art. Okay, whoever did the art, I love this art so much. All right, let me add one more clue, a postcard. Mm hmm Finish. Ah, oh, that looks so good. <laughs> okay. And oh my god, the fog really clears up. Just one flower and all the fog went away. I like that. I can see more clearly now. This looks more like a cozy, wholesome game that I would spend my time in it instead of a horror game that I might accidentally stumbled into. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, what's next? What is my next things to do? I don't have any more seed and I think I am... Shush, shush, shush. Let me turn this back. Mm -hmm. Just to 40. Keep the noise down, okay? We don't want the neighbor to get angry. Look. There are a lot of people in here. Is that my manner or is that someone else's manner? If that is my manner, I'm going to get so embarrassed, alright? And what should I do with you? Should I bring you around? No? I don't need to bring you around. And oh my god, it's it's moving. It's moving. Yeah. Alright. Wait, should I go out? Let me take a look. Um, I think we are done with the chapter 1, yeah? Because it says a fresh start. And actually, now that it looks really fresh right now, the whole chapter title means more to me. Yeah, it's a fresh start because look, look, a fresh clean look. Okay, no more fog around us. Mm-hmm. Alright, let's continue. Mm-hmm. And yes, I can go here, right? This is my own house. I don't need to be worried. Someone will come after me and say, You are trespassing into this house. No. I am the mayor owner. Mm hmm. Is there anything that I can touch in here? Oh, I can sit. Can I sit? Oh, I can sit. Oh, oh I get an achievement. <laughs> Take a break. <laughs> Thank you. That. Having a taking a break into an achievement means that this is a game where you can definitely relax. Okay, this is what the game purpose is. For you to take a break. <sighs> okay, let's sit here for a moment, guys. Let's appreciate the view. Yeah, please tell me that is not my house. <laughs> because that if that is my house, I'm going to get so embarrassed. Alright, because I say that is someone else's manner. Alright, breaks over. Alright, what is that? Just a branch? I can pick that up. Okay. And let me check what is this. Drawing book. Drawing from nature. Alright, can I open that one? No? Alright. Text overlay. Yeah, just that one. Okay, let's continue. Mm-hmm. Let's take... Yeah, I don't think there is anything else that we can inspect in here. Okay, can I take the stone with me? Do you want to explore my manor with me, stone? No. The stone doesn't want to go with us. Okay, fine. Let's just leave the stone be. He likes his Q time, his quality stone time. And let me open this door. 
This looks like the Alice in Wonderland door that will take you to the Queen of Hearts garden. Ta -ta! It's not! Okay. There is music. Mm -hmm. Relaxing music. Is there anything that I can look around? Okay. So many plants. It's so green. Okay. I don't think that we should call the house that we start in greenhouse. I think we should call this one the greenhouse. Oh, is that my manor? I think that is our manor. I think that is definitely our manor now. Okay, apparently we are rich. Apparently, no, Arabella is rich. Okay, if but if she has a manor, why would she just come back here now? Okay, can I go here? I want to take a look in here. Oh, this is the gate. I see. Also, am I going to be alone in this manner or do I have someone else to share this house with? Mm -hmm. Botany Manor, home of the Greene family. Greene or green? Alright. Oh, I can zoom in. Ooh, inspect that home of the Greene family. <laughs> they really live up to their name. Greene family, green family. Alright. I'm currently busy researching. Please leave all the liveries in the gatehouse and ring the bell. Arabella. Okay. And oh, there is a key. Collect key. For the entrance garden. Okay, what garden is that? Okay, let me just take that. Oh, oh, oh! The map is starting to come together. You guys can see that. There is a gatehouse. Where's the... Oh, that's the entrance garden. I see. So we were supposed to come here to pick up the key. And then finally, we can go inside the house. I see. Mm-hmm. All right. Let me take that. Also, let me just ring the bell myself. I like that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, no neighbor around, I think. No one can catch the owner of this manor playing with the bell by herself. I mean, her name is Arabella. She is supposed to ring the bell, at least sometimes, in her life. And I'm sure it's been quite a while since she last rang the bell herself. So thank you, Arabella. No, you're welcome, Arabella. I did you a really great job by ringing the bell for your name's sake. I guess I'm pretty alone by myself. Alright, let me just walk slowly. Yeah, because if I'm moving really fast like this. Oh, oh, see, see, see. Okay, we need to calm down. We need to catch a break, okay? <laughs> just take it like you have a grandma with you that are supposed to walk slowly instead of walking really fast. Alright, can I sit here again? Yeah. Okay, just take in the view. Oh my god, it looks so beautiful. <laughs> Alright. I feel like we always need to sit down sometimes and appreciate the house. Wait, let me look at the map. This is supposed to lead to... I think the long H row. I think. Okay, is there anything that I can check? No? Excuse me, three, you are blocking my view. Okay, how many stairs that we have in this garden? Can I just take one of the stairs with me? Alright, I think it's still locked for now. Oh, this is the long H row. I see. What do I need to do? Okay, calm down. Sit here for a moment. No. <laughs> I just like sitting on every bench that I come into. But there are so many bench around, I have to admit. Oh my god, it looks so beautiful. Can I stand under here? <sighs> Meditation. With water powering down my head. Yes. This is the life that I come for. This is the life that I sign up for. Mm -hmm. Okay, what should I do though with this 
when? I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go for now. Oh, I can. Oh no, it's locked from the other side. Okay, hello from the other side. That is what Adele used to say. But now Arabella is going to say that as well. Uh, maybe I can walk around this road. Yeah, maybe I can make my way around the house. Around. Oh no, it's blocked. Okay. I can't go there just yet, I think. Although, if you guys want a sneak peek of what lies behind that door, you can see that patio. I want to rest in that patio. Alright. And honestly, this kind of scenery, this kind of ambience, this kind of environment, it's making me relax. Okay, I might forgot to make a joke, guys, because I am enjoying this relaxing experience. So I guess you need to be independent and make a joke by yourself, alright? Wait, did I come in here already? What is that? Oh, there is a hat. Can I take that? No? Oh, there is several letters. Let me read that. Ah, Eleanor? Wow, Arabella has a lot of friends. Okay, you are an extrovert, aren't you, Arabella? My dear friend, good luck on your trip. I would have loved to join you like in our younger days, but your tales about the trip will suffice when we next meet. I will never forget the Maria Jackson passage you once hiked like to me. In examining plates, you take the authority of others, whereas in botany, as in all other things, we can make little progress if we do not see for ourselves. Well, now you must travel and see some interesting specimens for yourself. I'm inspired and look forward to hearing all about it. Your friend always, Eleanor. That is so wholesome. Okay, can I take the cane? No? I can't? Zoom in? Why do I need to zoom in on a walking stick? Why would I need to crouch down, okay, like this? And take a really, really good look at this walking stick. I don't understand. But yeah, is this written by my friend? I have so many friends, honestly. Okay, let me take a look. Is there anything that I can do? Mm hmm Where's my index? A fresh start. Okay. And I think that is all. So now we are here in chapter 2, I think. Let me just walk around. Okay, is this where I came from? I actually forgot. I think this is where I came from. No, this is an orchard. Let me take a look at the map. Mm -hmm. If you have been here in the channel long enough and you don't know that I am bad with direction, well, here it is. The proof of my bad direction. Okay, can I enter the orchard? Oh, oh, calm down. Chill, Arabella, chill. <laughs> there is an achievement. Let me in. It says let me in. Oh, no. No, they're, they're actually telling me to act that one. Act that achievement. Let me in! Let me in! Let me in! Yeah, we can. I think we were supposed to do this in number. I think we were supposed to do this in number. So we have come from conservatory, driveway... Entrance garden. Wait, so we were supposed to go to the long H row, right? Because here I am in the garden, in the entrance garden, and I see nothing that can pique you my interest. Wait, can I jump? Developer, can I jump into the fountain? Oh my god, that water looks delicious. That water looks delicious. Okay, I just want to jump in and bathe. And drink the water at the same time. Is Does that make sense to you guys? I want to do both at the same time. Drink and bathe. Alright. Oh, is this the place where we finally go inside the house? No? Ah, the duck! Ah, the duck! Can I take this please? Oh my god. Quack, quack! Inspect a duck. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know what? You know what? Oh my god. Okay. Screenshot. Screenshot. No, wrong! Wrong! Wrong button to press! <laughs> I am so excited! Oh my gosh, I want to screenshot the duck, please! 
Wait, wait, wait. Okay, let me screenshot the duck and I will get back to you. There are so many things that I have to screenshot here because it looks so adorable. <laughs> okay, I screenshot that. Alright, oh my god, they have ducks! So cute! The duck is so cute. Can I take you with me, duck? Please come with me. Do you want to explore the manor? The Arabella manor, duck? Quack, quack. No? Oh my god. Alright, so I think our next planting, our next flower should be in here. But the problem is that I don't see any seeds around. Let me take a look around. There should be some seeds around. Oh, there is a chair. Sit here. Hmm. Okay, let me inspect the house. I see no seed. Okay, what about this one? A letter. Letter from sister. Alright. My dearest Arabella, I hope this letter finds you well as you set up for London on your important trip. The thought of you in the bustling city working on your ambitions both excite and worries me. Are they really sister? I don't think sister will write a very kind letter like this. Time has indeed passed. And yet your determination for your field remains inspiring to me. I never imagined all those years ago that we would be writing to each other in our fifth decade about such endeavors. I look forward to hearing about your progress and of course let me know how I can be of assistance upon your return. Your loving sister, Elizabeth. I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to be that person. But are you adopted, Arabella? This is not the way how sisters spoke to each other. Okay, most of the time, sisters spoke I with each other by degrading the other. Alright? It's full with hostility and violence and cursing. Not like your loving sister. This is a fake sister. I don't feel like this is the real sister, Arabella. Maybe you need to check your family tree, your DNA. Do they have DNA tests at this time of the year just yet? And also one of the things that I'm proud of when I see this duck sitting right here is that the knowledge that during this 80s year, during the 80s year, they still appreciate duck. They appreciate duck already, okay? So it's good to know that the people in the past love duck as much as I do. Alright, let me in. Ooh, I got jump scared by you! Clothes and... Is it? Oh, that's the beginning of the chapter. Survivors of Adversity. Alright, welcome to my manor! Please come in guys, take a seat, take a seat. No seat, I'm sorry, just sit on the floor, right in front of the fireplace. Make yourself comfortable while I go around the table, alright? Oh wait, there is some, oh there is something glowing, oh that's the seat, alright, calm down, chill. Oh wait! <laughs> oh my god, this reminds me so much of the train to Paddington? 430... Oh, I forgot the name of the title, but... There is... If you guys know about Agatha Christie, the mi mystery... Yeah, mystery, criminal... Not criminal, it's crime. Yeah, crime, mystery, author. Agatha Christie. I think she comes from UK as well. I think she's British. She has a book. And yeah, about murder in a train bound to Paddington and seeing this ticket, alright, it feels like they are referring to that time. Although I hope not. I hope not. Although that would be a really good reference for placing these tickets right here and saying that it's bound to Paddington. Alright, is this my clothes? I think this is my clothes. Okay, you are not going to move, right? Clothes? Okay, please behave. Alright, let me sit on the chair. Mm-hmm. I have to sit on every chair that I saw. Looking around. And what is this? Oh, this is the family tree. Alright. Let me take a look. 
Oh, wait, our great great grandmother is Ursula. Oh, she's being featured in Little Mermaid. I'm so happy. Wait, let me take a look. Richard Green, Mary Deal, and there we are. Arabella Mary, and our sister is Elizabeth Anne. Oh, wait, our parents have already passed away. Oh, I see. Oh, wait. Did our mother... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think our mother passed away after giving birth to our sister, I think? And our sister is married. Yeah, that's why she is not here right now. And I'm here alone. Okay, without anyone because I don't have a partner right now. Arabella doesn't have any partner as of now, alright? Letter from genealogist. Alright, wait. Lady Arabella Green. I'm pleased to let you know that your family tree is complete. Carefully tracing the history of your lineage, lineage, lineage. I think I'm saying it wrongly. I think I should have said it as lineage. As per your request, I have altered the customary presentation. Now displaying the maiden name of the ladies in your family, rather than their current names, acquired through marriage. Hmm? Should you require any further adjustment or have additional inquiries, I remain at your service. Yours, Robert Hinckley, genealogist. Thank you, Robert! Alright, will you come in here to my mansion, Robert? And sit here on the chair with me, Robert, in front of the fireplace, Robert. Okay, kitchen, Dartmoor. Oh. Travel by train to Dartmoor. I think... No, I don't remember. But I think there used to be... It's either a movie or a book featuring Dartmoor as well. Mm-hmm. What is this? Pyro... Pyro... Pyro Piles. Yeah, Pyro Piles. Pyre has the potential to be among the most devastating forces of nature. Despite this, humans have developed the ability to invent, wield, and attempt to manage it. Yeah, hello, explosion! Meanwhile, certain species in the plant kingdom have evolved to adapt and flourish in the face of fire. Huh? Really? There is a plant that cannot be burned? In areas where forest fires occur frequently, okay, pyro piles have learned to rely on fire as a crucial part of their life cycle. That's new, okay? Okay, I, I feel like I'm learning something in here. So I'm going to be really serious and read this, guys. So you guys better pay attention as well. Facts about pyrophiles. Their seeds typically possess tough cell shells. Some pyrophiles only bloom when surrounded by smoke aromas from their natural habitat. Alright, and that's the end of the book. Oh, I think I have to figure out like which one of them that is a part of Pyrophiles. I think I need to complete this book as well because this figure is so blurry, okay? It's on 144 pixel. I can't see anything over there. Okay, there's bacteries, there's painting room, wait, wait, wait. All in due time, okay? All in due time. Let me just get the seeds here. Alright, let me get you. Mm hmm Fulguria. Oh, wait, there are so many clues. I came across the Fulguria when I was caught in a terrible thunderstorm. I am interested to learn more about its growth requirement. Yep. Alright, let me just take that with Moi. Well, I'm figuring out on what to do. Alright. What is this? Well lit photograph. Is that how Fulguria is going to bloom? Okay, camera experiment too. I'm very 
very pleased with this picture. Looks like I'm getting the hang of the camera. Oh, that is also what we used to say right now. Once we figure out how filter works in Instagram. Alright. Oh, dark photograph. Huh? The picture is so dark. Impossible to see the flowers. Yeah, we can't. We cannot see anything. I can't believe how quickly I have run out of that incredibly expensive flash powder. Oh, they're using that old style camera, right? Where the photographer will go into this cover behind the camera where he hides himself from us while we are posing in front of the camera. And this one is a blurry. I purchased a new camera and flash lamp to document my flowers. The picture looks a little blurry though. I'll have to investigate the camera settings. Alright. So many pictures. And for what though? Okay. Are you a piece of that Pyrofiles book? No? What is this room? Can I open that one? Knock knock. Anyone inside? Coming in through. This room's so big. Honestly. Oh my god. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Please don't tell me that I have to make something with this. Okay, what is that? Sand glass. I like that sand glass. Sulfur, potassium, magnesium, phosphorus, sodium, titanium, zinc, bar... <laughs> okay. Okay, wait, why would you put... Okay, can I take a look at my own face? No, I, I can't sing a reflection to Mulan song. Where will my reflection go? Yeah, I alter the lyric. What is this book? The Art of Painting. Yeah, I can't open the book. Okay, let me sit here. Let me ponder the meaning of this chemical liquid. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, there is... <laughs> there is an achievement if I sit in one seat for a minute or so. Alright. I think I sit a lot. I'm so sorry. Your vampire grandma needs to take a rest a little bit. Wait. Mm. Wait, what? I can ex I can inspect this one? Oh, Arabella's parents. Yeah, like I will recognize them from their shadows. I can't, alright? Oh, oh, oh. I don't think I need to do anything with this. I'm not going to touch you for now. Alright? Let me just put you there. And... Wait, what plan are you? No, I can't know what plan are you, alright? Wait, let me go back to here. Mm-hmm. And... Oh, the seat's in here already. Okay, let me put the soil. Put... Wait, where, where is my seat? Okay. Plan... Full... 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 Full Guria. Yeah, I forgot. Fulguria and water them. Okay. But I still don't know what to do. Like, where should I place them? Okay. And maybe... Photograph and Pyrophiles and Dartmoor poster. I'm just going to put everything that I find on there, alright? And where should we go next? Where should we go next? Can we go upstairs? I think we can go upstairs. But wait, not yet. Also, I think I should have asked this question from the first time I walk into this room. What is the purpose of this tree? Okay? I mean, we have so many trees in this room. Family tree and now this tree as well. What is this tree? Can I climb on this? No? I mean... Is this the new... Is this like the most hot decoration thing? Like the most popular thing to decorate in your house? To put inside your house? In this day and age? In the 80s? Alright, let me just check the painting room. Not, oh, it's locked. Alright, back terrace, it's locked. Okay, should I say let me in again? I don't think sh I should. Okay, there is a duck. I don't think I can. What about you? Can I open you? No, it's locked as well. Alright. Maybe upstairs. Maybe we are bound to go upstairs for now. Let's get up there. 
Okay, don't chime. Do not chime. Okay, clock. I might get jump scared. All right. Okay, sit here. Sit here. Take a break. Take a break. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> All right. You know, I am getting paranoid actually because I watch horror game too much. I watch people playing horror game too much. And right now, I reap what I saw because I am feeling like I am in a haunted house right now. Oh, I can open this one. Knock knock! Oh yeah, this is the second floor and there is a door in here. It says, Library Hall. Lock with a set of number. Perfect. I don't know what number is. Can I just put 000 on there or 911? No? Okay, can I open this one? Block by... Tr ah, sh should I burn you? Wait, are you the type of tree that triumph in fire? Are you a pyrophile? Honestly, is this really named as pyrophile? Because I feel like I'm saying it like a pedophile. Okay, um... Should I burn it using... Yeah, I think I should make something using this. But the problem is that I don't know what to make. Yeah. There is no recipe in everywhere. And I still need some more clues. Can I just mix all of this up? What will happen if I mix all of this up? Zinc. Okay. Titanium. So sodium. Wait, that's all? Okay, what, 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 then what should I do? What should I do with this? What should I do with this? Hello? Anyone knows what to do with this? Can I burn you in the air? No? Okay, anyone knows what I should do with this flask? Should I put it inside you? No, right? Okay, let me just put you there. And... Wait, why are you closing down on me? Calm down, Fulgria. I haven't even done anything to you. Alright? Can you please grow? The duck is staring at you. Please grow. No? This Fulguria is shy. Okay, he has growing problem. Alright, let me put you back there. And I still don't know what to do with this flask. Let me think up of a way to do something with this. No? Hmm, what should I do with you? Let me just check if I can pour this on that tree up there. Knock knock. Knock knock. Yeah, excuse me. One flask coming through. Powering this at you. I can't. <laughs> I don't even know what I make. Alright. And I think I need to figure out the number. Letter? Letter? It's a letter. Oh, I thought it's a number. Oh no, that's hard. Okay, let me put this down. Let me put this back where it belongs. And let me check if I can make up a combination of anything from what I have. Okay, throw it there. Alright. Put it there. Let me check my option. Alright, I'm going to check it here. Right beside the duck. We are brainstorming ideas right now. Where is my... Mm-hmm. Wait, can I take a look at each of the clue that I get? Wait, or should I go through them like one by one? Mm, I don't think I can. Yeah, I don't think I can check them like one by one. I think I have to go at them myself. Wait, Dartmoor poster. Yeah, I can. And this one as well. Ash Bloom. This might be a tough case to crack. Oh, and the seed packet location is in Rose Garden. Where is Rose Garden? Okay, let me take a look. Let me take a look. Let me brainstorm this. Mm -hmm. Back to the map we go. Which one of you that is a rose garden? Oh, it's on the back. Wait, how do I get there? Mm. Orchard. Can I go through the orchard now? I don't think I can. Wait, let me take a look. Is there like a way from here? No, it's blocked, right? Yeah, it's blocked. <laughs> Alright, so after I try...
try to find my way back to yeah after i try to find my way into this one into the rose garden i don't think i can find my way to the rose garden just now i think the only way to go there is from the inside so let me just go back to this house and oh wait 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 arabella mary green should we use her initial yeah amg amg yeah it should be like omg but just replace the o with a let's try amg if if that is supposed to be my name my initial a mm -hmm. oh no they don't have that they don't have that okay they only have until what until what until i wow okay they only have until i that means i have to find something that have the sign of three words i need three words all right don't you have anything in here no camera experiment two camera experiment three wait let me take a look oh it's date like three days okay back to back i think Oh, and... Yeah, is there anything that I can check in here? AOP? No, I can't do that. Oh, wait, I can actually open this one. <laughs> I did not realize that I can open this one. Alright. Is dinner served? Okay. It's actually pretty creepy because I'm the only one in the house. And they have all of this plate and glass and utensils lined up. Alright. Oh, there is this bell! This is the bell that you ring when you want to call like someone, right? I think that is the rose garden. But I need to find my way around. Wait. Botanical folk tales. Some ancient Celtic tribes practiced a coming of age ritual. This meant that when someone was considered old enough, it was time to prove themselves worthy of staying in the tribe. Honestly, I really love the font that they use in this game. The font that they use to write the letter. The font that they use to retell the story. I like all of their fonts, Hannes. One of these rituals involved picking a flower in the woods. So, not just any flower, of course. There it is! The gatherer had to find a fulguria, for this flower is known to only bloom during thunderstorms. Thunderstorm! And what should I do? How can I make a rain and a thunder? Should I just... put electricity on, on that plane? <laughs> thunder has electricity, right? Keeping a cool hat while lightning flash or streaking left and right of you was considered the ultimate test of courage. Yeah, but how does one remake a lightning when one does not have Pikachu on her Pokemon ball? Yes, let me just sit here. Let me wallow in sadness because I don't have Pikachu in my Pokeball right now. Okay, do you have Pikachu inside the cupboard? No? How one was supposed to make a lightning? Okay, can I open you? I can. Oh my god, this house is really huge. Oh, there is a piano! There is a piano! Can I, can I play? Oh, I can. Oh, there is an achievement. Piano woman. <laughs> piano woman. Alright. Oh, so many things to inspect here. Oh! Ah! Ah! I see. I get it. I get it. I was supposed to bring that Fulguria here. Let me bring you, Fulguria. Come with me. Take you home. Take you home to the thunderstorm. It's not a thunderstorm, but we are going to remake mini thunderstorm. With the camera flash, alright? Let me pick you up, Fulguria. Come with me. You are going to feel your first thunderstorm. Your first man-made thunderstorm. No, woman-made thunderstorm. Alright, let me put you in there. Time to get you ready to be the brand ambassador of thunderstorm plan. 
Oh, there you are. You are growing so nicely. You love it here, hmm? I see, Fulguria. I see. But not yet. Not yet. There is a chair. I <laughs> I can paste through the object. Alright. Please don't break. Please don't break, game. Please don't break. Alright. Let me sit here. Oh my god. So cozy. <laughs> so cozy in here. Alright. I might actually just turn on this game and then put my character right here sitting in the sofa and just listening to the ambience while I'm doing something else because honestly the ambience that they provide is really really cozy comfy and yes I forgot to tell you guys that don't forget to make yourself comfortable cozy and I hope that this video this game and my experience with this game can make you happy I forgot to say that I got a little too excited. Hey, let me. Ooh, spectacles. That looks cool. Mm hmm. And this is the flash lamp manual. All right, your new Lumen photographic flash lamp. Fill the container with flash powder. Close the container. Oh no, no, we're not doing this. I'm, I'm going to do that. But wait. Okay, let me inspect things. Oh, that's. Me, Arabella and Elizabeth. Wow, oh my god. Which one is Arabella? Because that one, the one that is sitting down, it has a very scary expression on her. I hope that's not us. Okay. Although I think it would be better if it's us. So that... Oh! Back there is. Alright, that is our key to the back garden later on. Okay, not now. Mm -hmm. Another letter. Oh! Farmer Charles, Lady Arabella. These past weeks, I have been seeing lots of bright, fl <laughs> bright flashes coming from the back room of your house. It scares my cows immensely as they think a storm must be coming. Yeah, this is the hint. This is the hint. If you don't get the hint just by looking at the camera and then, well... Relating that to a thunderstorm and a flashing thunderstorm. This is the hint. My milk production has taken a hit because of this. And if you enjoy fresh milk in your morning cup of tea, I would advise you to keep the flashes to a minimum. Ah, Farmer Charles, are you threatening me? But, the, but he's threatening me with a milk. And you guys know how much I love fresh milk. Full cream milk, so... Yeah. Just one more flashes, Farmer Charles. One more flashes, and you can eat me away, okay? Oh, this is the flesh powder, but... Ah, this is where it comes from. That is how our chemical knowledge that is non-existent right now has finally existed all right we need to mix potassium and magnesium to 0.1 ratio all right let me make that be right back guys be right back tiktok model wait there fulguria i'm going to make you look instagrammable mm -hmm. i'm going to bring you to for your page fyp wait what is it again i forgot i make that joke and i forgot Coming back. Okay. I'm back. But not yet. Alright. Don't be happy to see me. Let me check. Ma potassium and magnesium. Two potassium, one magnesium. Two potassium, one magnesium. Two potassium, one magnesium. Two potassium. Two potassium. Two potassium. Yes. Two potassium. Mm -hmm, two potassium and one magnesium. Nice. Let me bring you. Mm -hmm. Come here. Come with me. Time to become the greatest flask powder ever to replicate. Wait, what? Oh, I'm just going to put it inside the container. Which one? Or oh, this one? Okay, that is the container. Mm hmm. And can I put you somewhere? Let me just put you here. Alright. Thank you. And where is the manual? Let me check the manual. Fill the container with flash powder. Done. Close the container. Alright. Let me close you. Close you. Oh, okay. Almost ready. Almost ready. This is the first time I'm using this kind of camera. So I'm excited as well. Mm-hmm. 
Press the button connected to the camera and the lumen flash lamp. Witness a bright flash. All right. Wait, should I use this? Oh, this is the photo, right? It's going to appear in here. So all I have to do is just press this one, I think. All right. Farmer Charles, be careful of the cows. Just one more time. Just one more flash, all right? Take a picture. Ooh, so bright. Oh, it's growing. Oh, that looks so good. And we got achievement, yes. Oh my gosh. I love their art so much. <laughs> Who likes full gurus? The full guria only grows during thunderstorm, where the flashes of lightning provide the bright light the flower needs to bloom. Oh, that is why they only bloom during thunderstorm. They need that light. They need that flash of light. Oh, then we can just bring them to a disco club, and I think it will grow there. Because of its dangerous growing conditions, not many people have witnessed its beauty. Wow. Okay, let me put that one. Flash lamp manual, letter from farmer, and flash powder bottle. Honestly, I don't think pyro pyrophiles play a lore in this. So yes, this one is the correct clue. Oh my god, this is so cool. Alright, thank you. We are done with that one. Okay, Farmer Charles, say my hello to your cow. I'm waiting for your fresh milk tomorrow. Alright. And yeah, I think that is all for this plan. Uh-huh. And I think our next journey is to go to the back garden. Let me save. Okay, save. And yeah, wait, let me check. Where is the back garden? Excuse me. Uh-huh. Back terrace. How can I get there? Back terrace. Is there a door? Oh, no. This is not a door. I thought this is a door. <laughs> it's a huge window, not a door. So where can I find my door? Are you a door? No, you are a window. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to get lost in this house because I don't know how to get to the... Wait, what is it again? Back garden, yes. Because I don't know my way to the back garden. Wait, can I go to the kitchen now? Let me check. Kitchen, knock knock. No, it's still locked. What about that one? Is that back garden? Is that what it says? Back terrace. Yeah, let me go inside. Alright. Ooh! Alright, here we are in the back terrace. Oh my god. Look, look, look. They have a tear and a teapot. Oh my god, I love that teapot. So cute. So cute. Can I sit here? No? Oh, I want to play tea party. Oh no. Whose bread is this? Whose sandwich is this? Arabella, did you not finish your food, Arabella? Oh gosh. Wait, wait. Let me check around. Let me check. Ah, oh, let me sit here. Ah. <sighs> Ooh. Ah, the fresh air. And I love, oh my god, the ambience, that, that little mountain that they put over there. Is that a mountain or is that a hill? I live in a country where it is full with mountains. So the first thing I think of when I see like huge land like that, high land like that, I immediately think of a mountain. Alright, let me inspect this book. Mm -hmm. Flowering plants, Great Britain, and Pratt. Okay, and open that one as well. And I think they are a real book. I think they are a real book. And if you are curious about what they have written inside that, I think you can actually check them out yourself by buying it in real life, I think. Oh, this is where we are going to start our gardening time, I see. Mm -hmm. Because honestly... I feel like I recognize some of the name of the author that they put in here. But of course, I can't know. I have to search on Google before I can make anything, before I can make any claim to that. Oh, this is the... Yeah, this is where I was before. And that is our seat. Let me take that seat. Mm -hmm. Let me take our seat. And... Yep. Oh yeah, we can actually sprint. We can sprint, but I forgot which button. Oh, this one. Yeah, we can sprint. Okay, wait. So many... 
Seed? Wait, you are a seed. Yeah, you are a seed. Oh, you are the ash plum. Alright. This might be a tough case to crack. Oh, I think you are a paraphile because it says tough case to crack. And in the book paraphiles, it is mentioned that these seeds have a very tough shells. Let me read this. Seed lock. A summary of some seeds I have gathered this year and the location I found them at. Okay, co parsley, dark down hills. Poppy, we have Poppy. Chatter George, Buttercup Steered Marshes, Ash Plum Wistman's Wood, Wood Edmond Holford Combe. <laughs> I hope I say their name right. I'm so sorry if I butchered that. Well Time Cool Bone Wood, Fox Glow Fort Abbey. Wow. Wait, is that like a spoiler about all the plans that we need to plan in this game? Oh, uh, I can't... Okay, burying my face in the book? No, nothing. Alright. There should be another seat. There should be another seat. But, oh, oh, wait. I don't think I can go there. Yeah. I think it's a different seat than the one I saw. Let me sprint. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I guess I can't reach that place just yet. I mean, excuse me. Okay, let me use my hand. Let me try to get that seat. Oh no, my hand's too short. I don't even think I have a hand in this game. It's practically non-existent, the hand. So that's why I can't reach for the seat when it's really close to me. Alright, yeah, I will try to find a way to make flames, I guess. Because that is what Parafiles does. Can I open this one? Formal garden. Knock knock. Open up! Open up! There is another duck inside! There is a duck statue! Open up! Open up! I need to appreciate the duck! Open up! Let me in! Okay. Enough. Enough being hyperactive. Enough. Enough. We need to be calm, relaxed, with elegance because we are right now the Lady Arabella, the Lady of this ma manor, the lake's so cool! See, that is the kind of water that you just want to drown in. Not like literally drown, but like, yeah, like what I say, take a bath and drink at the same time. Let me take a look at the letter. Okay, my dear friend Arabella, another friend. A friend of mine visited the Americas and brought back a pair of fabulous gray squirrels. They are the latest trend in garden decoration. All of my neighbors have sent for them as well. Gray squirrels. Is that a real squirrels or is that a flower? I have my dub. Because I thought catnip means a cat, but apparently it's a plant. It was a great investment. The two squirrels have now started a big family and my garden is full of the darling little creatures. Oh, that is an animal. One thing I did notice is that I haven't seen a red squirrel in my garden for some time now. How odd. You must visit soon and see the squirrel for yourself. Every yours, Grace. Chata, chata, chata. Wait, wait, wait. Gray squirrels. And then, Grace mentioned that she hasn't seen any red squirrel. I don't know what that means, but I will take that into my brain. I will take that into account. Alright, thank you, Grace. And oh my god, so many friends. You have Arabella. You are very friendly. Social butterfly, you are actually. And alright. There is a chair. Let me sit in the bench. Alright. <laughs> I love how they put the chair in every turn that I come into. It's like literally telling me to take a break. Oh my god, can I free dive my way into there? Oh my god, Arabella, you are rich. You are rich, alright? Okay, there is a key for the kitchen. Oh, that is where the fireworks comes from. I see where this is leading to. 
or maybe not, Thursday with I want to read the diary. Hazel Patterson, Kitchen Notes. Thursday, Jimmy broke another mortar. That boy really needs to learn how to green spices without breaking down my kitchen. Oh, Jimmy needs to have a nation mother. Okay, if he breaks the mortar, his mother is going to green him himself. Lady Arabella may not be best pleased with me asking for a new one. The last mortar took years to be sorted. She's so scatterbrain, always off on her fancy research trips. Oh no. Oh no, Hazel Patterson. You are fired, Hazel Patterson. Because this lady Arabella saw what you are doing. Oh, it's locked from the other side. Yeah, so I guess our next destination is probably the kitchen. Although I'm wondering where are the servants at. Then again, I'm happy that they make this house empty because if they have other NPC walking around, if they have other people walking around, I'm going to be getting jump scared. I'm going to get jump scared a lot, okay? Because right now, I'm actually really tense. I'm afraid that something might jump out on me at any times. And I'm trying to calm myself by saying this is a relaxing game. A flower cannot hurt you. Alright, chill. Wait, is this... Oh, wait, where is this? Oh yeah, that's where I came from. But this one, wh what house this is? Excuse me? Walking back just to inspect that? I don't know what house that is. Alright, slowly but surely walking back into the house. Okay, painting room is still locked, so let me go to the kitchen. Let me open you up. Okay, you better have a stove in there because I'm going to be burning things right now. Hello! Kitchen! <sighs> the smell of food! The smell of so many bottles attacking me. I've been attacked by so many bottles. What is that bottles? How many bottles that we have? What is that? Let me see you. Mysterious symbol. Yeah, very mysterious indeed. A shape of sheep. Sheep. Oh, I'm sorry. A shape of sheep. Yes, bringing a flag with him. Is that ship going to war? Is that ship going to attend ceremony? We don't know. That is very mysterious indeed. Alright. Oh, there is a... Hazel's priceless recipe. Oh no, Hazel, you are going to get really priceless after this. Okay, because Lady Arabella has found your complaint about her. Let me read that. For the home... Farm, workshop, and every department of human and the four. Proven true. Yes. Roasted. Chest. Chestnut. Oh, we're burning the seed, isn't it? <laughs> this is a simple recipe. Perfect to warm those cold winter nights. You can use any edible chestnut. They are easily foraged. The main difficulty with chestnut is that they have a tough shell. But luckily, they are easy to crack open with the help of fire. Simply place the nuts in a pan above the fire and wait until you hear a pop. This means that your chestnuts are nicely roasted and ready to eat. Okay, that is the end. That is the end of your recipe. Hazel, that's all the recipe that you have. Okay. Oh. Religious blessing. Oh, wait. Oh, oh. Oh, I see. So that mysterious symbol is... Actually comes, I think, from the church. Or from this guy, Nicholas Owen. Yeah, it says, Blessed in this kitchen. By grace and holy like. May all those who enter find comfort and respite. Blessed is the heart, with laughter and with cheer, may the love shared here be held forever dear. To those who serve the Lord, who seek their sanctuary, remember the year of construction. For this, friends, is the key. Alright. And honestly, I thought for a second that all of these highlighted 
word, this caps lock word, BBT, can be used to unlock the library hall. But I just remembered that the words up there that we need only has a maximum to I, so this T cannot go with us. Alright. What does that mean? I'm so sorry, but... Oh, I don't know what that means. Okay, let me just take a look at the battle. Oh, oh, I think I need to... I think there is a hidden door behind this place. Or something, and I need to put the exact year, I think. The year of the blessing that he says. In, yeah, using this wake. And I still don't know. Is there like any other clue around here about what year of blessings I might need that? Oh, that is the mortar. Hmm. Yes, you are going to get grinded by your mother. If your mother is Asian mother, Jimmy. Alright. Oh, is this the history of Dartmoor? Given by our resident natural history professor. Wait, wait. Um, the professor will present how the moor was once covered in majestic forests and woods, how early settlers came to the area and cleared most of the trees for pasture, using fire as their method of choice. It promised to be a fascinating story of how the moorland we know and love today came into existence. And there is next lecture, but it's blank. And there is new members, but it's blank. Okay, who's joining cult? Is that a cult or is that a church? I don't understand. I don't know. Wait, let me check this paper right here. They have so many paper. Old la Huh? University College London. Dear lady, we received your letter applying to study botany. At our College of Natural Science, along with your enclosed drawings, wait. We do not, at present, and have never admitted women to study at the college. Oh gosh, that is so sad. Oh, we are living in those day and era where having women wanting to go to college and just pursuing education is shame upon. Is thrown upon, I think. Botany is a serious science conducted in laboratories and lecture halls. By all means, continue to pursue your hobby. Wow. He's saying it as our hobby. Tending to your garden and domestic space where it may be appreciated. Positions at the college are reserved for serious... Gosh, it hurts my heart to actually read this. Four serious scholars whose studies will go on to be well utilized in a career in botanical experimentation. Therefore, with all politeness, we do not offer these valuable positions to amateurs that should otherwise be taken up by genuine academic. Signed, Professor John Altringham. Oh my god. I want to curse, honestly. He is an ass. <laughs> he is an ass, okay? Oh my gosh. That is so sad, Arabella Pet Pet. Oh my god, I feel her pain. Just to be... Oh my god. I mean, the way they reject her. It is very harsh, okay? Even... Oh my god. I'm not the one receiving the letter, but even just reading that, it makes me really sad. It makes me like, oh my god. Poor Arabella. Yeah, I hope that you can pursue your study in botanical, even though it's not in College University of London, yes. Alright. Welcome to... Ah, da -da -da! Porcelain duck! Oh my god, that is cute. Can I take one of these with me? Developer, please. Let me let me be able to take my duck with me. Okay, I want to take this duck with me. So that we can go hand in hand together. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, why is that? A romantic card to someone special. Oh, dearest Hazel. Ooh, ooh. Ah, I see. I know the reason why this manor is empty. They're going on a date. Ah, 
I picked you some roses from the garden to cheer you up. Mm-hmm, Mr. Bennett. When you are done with your work in the kitchen, would you like to meet me for a cup of tea in the back garden? Oh, the pond is lovely this time of year. I see where it's going, Mr. Bennett. You want to have a lovey-dovey romance in this house. I see. You better not going on a date while gossiping about me, okay, Mr. Bennett? Okay, Hazel? Alright, can I open this one? Alright. Is this where they're having their date? I hope it's not. Ooh. <laughs> this is the garden that... Oh my god, we still can't access just yet, right? Yeah, we can. Alright, wait. So many things. Let me... See. Uh, all of these locks. Oh. Oak. Maple. Cherry. Birch. Oh no, this is going to affect what kind of fire that I want to make, isn't it? Let me go to this one. Let me read this one. Sm <laughs> smoking book. Alright. For a moment, I thought it's like smoking cigarette. But yeah, it's a different kind of smoking. Home smoking and curing. Using the home smokery. Mm -hmm. The type of wood to use in your smokery is of great importance. So, which one to pick depends entirely on your personal taste and preferences. Burning wood from different types of tree produces different smoke aromas. Oh. This is due to different chemical compositions in each type of smoke. And has a great impact on the flavor of your smoke food. So, in summary, choose your woodlocks with care. Yeah, but how can I make one? That is the question. What what wood is suitable to burn a plant? Hello? Okay, can I enter this one? Knock, knock. Oh, what is this? Smoke food. Oh, smells good. Smells delicious. Alright. Wait, that is all? Honestly, it looks more like a butcher place. Okay, it looks straight out of a place from a serial killer movie. And I still don't know what to do with... Oh, wait. Is that pot? Yeah, I think I should bring my pot here instead. Yeah, I think I should bring my pot here instead. Yeah, instead of placing it inside the oven, I need to put it there. Okay, carrot. Can I take that? No? Alright, let me get my plan. It's quite a long walk to my plan. Hello, that Oh, there is one that I almost missed. Wait. The ancient oak stand tall in Wistman's wood. Is that where we got this particular plan? I forgot his name. I forgot his name. I'm sorry. Covered in moss, they withstood the test of time. So none can tell the sorrows that did befell those trees in Wistman's wood. Okay. I think it is Ash Bloom. I think I get that from the Wistman's wood, I think. And yeah, I can't do anything with the broken mortar. So let me go back to the back garden and get my pot, yeah? Excuse me, wait, are you... No, you don't have any year of blessing as well. Do you have year of blessing? No? Not as well. Hmm. I don't know the year of blessing, so I can't do anything to that door. No, not that door, but to that wake. Yeah, I know I was supposed to put some wake over there. Wait, let me put the soil. Put the ash plum. Alright. Water that one. Alright. Come with me. We are going on a journey. Alright. Wait, let me read this book. Can I read book while I'm holding my plan? Mm-hmm. Ash plum. Yeah, it's from Wistman's Wood. Alright. I was right. Okay, so your origin is from Wistman's Wood. And we are about to enter into a makeshift Wisman's wood, I think. I hope so. Okay, let me walk you there, Ashplum. Let me bring you with me, with Moi. 
Okay, I can't do anything with that. I also don't know what to put on there. Alright, let me just bring you to the back of the house. I think. Or should I put it here? Oh, wait. It's actually moving. Oh! Wait, what? Germinate the ash bloom seed. Okay, it... What? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I have to bring you with me. Maybe to the back of the house. Let's go. Yeah, we need to crack that first. Alright. And now, I think a proper warm in this mockery will make you grow. Can I put you down there? No? Not there. Alright, wait. Mm. Mm. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Okay, my brain is working. Okay, my brain is trying to think about what I should put inside the cookery. Okay, be a good... Be a good plan. Yeah, I was about to say be a good girl. No, no. Be a good plan and stay there, okay? Let me try to find something. Okay, maybe one of this. Yeah, maybe all cloaks. Because Wistman's Wood. I think, yeah, I read that. It is... Okay, let me bring you here, here, in this text. In this text, it says that the ancient oak stand tall in Wisman's wood. So I think we need to put this oak lock inside the cookery in this place. Excuse me, not cookery, smokery, I'm sorry. Alright. Okay, burn. You are being burned. Nice. Okay, let me check up on my little plan. I hope it's growing because if not, I'm going to smack that plan with an oak locks. Alright. Is that? Oh, no. Alright, are you growing now? Not yet. Where should I bring you then? Should I bring you inside there? Let me try. Come with me, Ashbloom. I got your nice oak lock inside the smokery. Please grow. Okay. Grow, Ashbloom. Grow. Grow tall. Grow strong. I can't... Oh, in here. Oh. Wait, that's not... Oh, I have to bring it again. Okay. Let me get the oak lock again. This should work. This should work. Okay, we need to beat the bean, the jack plant, and make him able to go to sky. We want to go to sky too. With this lock. Grow. Please grow. Waiting? Mm-hmm. Ah! There it is! It's grown! Yes! 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 Oh my god, this is fun! Cracking puzzles after puzzles. Wait, let me change the clues. Yes. The ash bloom. Yeah, Lilium Fifi Ficum. The ash bloom is a paraphile evolved to survive harsh forest fires. Each seed cracks open with extreme heat, and afterwards the oak smoke from its habitat indicates it's safe to bloom. Yes, 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 pyrophile, and then smoking book, and then cooking book, and then seed lock, and then, oh my god, so many things. Home, and then, I think Dartmoor poster, Dartmoor lecture, yes, 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 yes. Okay, we finished that one. I'm so happy. Alright, is that all? Yeah, I think that is all. Alright. Should I take them with me or should I just left them be? Oh my god. Don't jump scare me, get house delivery. Okay, I think that is another key. So let's get that key. Alright. Oh, happy music. Nice. I like this. Okay, happy music, happy music, happy music. We managed to make three plants grow. Yes, and we not managed to make the mansion destroyed. Nice. Oh, wait. Where is the way to... Oh, here. <laughs> I almost forgot. Let me get that. Hello, duck! Let me pat you, white duck. Alright. Oh, my god. I like the music. Banger music. Let me run. Let's just run all the way to the mansion. Okay. Here I come. Delivery. Let me take that off your hand. Mm-hmm. 
What key that you have delivered upon us? Our child. Alright. Oh, we finished chapter 2. That is nice. I'm happy we finished chapter 2. Alright. Oh, I can't catch a glimpse of who delivered my key. Alright, I'm banning everyone from the house, I think. Because Lady Arabella wants to focus on researching. And Lady Arabella doesn't want to have anyone, okay? Messing around, dating around, especially while she's working on her research. Mm-hmm. Wait. Maps. Where is Orchard? Oh, that door. Alright. That should be this way. Yeah, should be this way. Let's go this way. Knock, knock. Orchard, I have the key to open you. Mm-hmm. Open up. Alright. Ah, new chapter. Peculiar puddles. Okay. New plans added. Let me take a look at that. Okay, where's the index? What plan did you have for Moi? Pixie Tears and Wolf Glove. Okay. Wolf Glove and Pixie Tears. This flower is closely associated with orchards. I wonder why. I wonder why. I wonder how. I also don't know why. Wait, let me sit in here. <sighs> Let's relax in here for a little moment. Okay? I can see something glowing over there in the distance and I think that is our seat. Mm hmm Let me look around. Everything looks nice. Okay, let me go up and read this one. Huh? Note to Florence. Oh, I see. To our niece. Yeah. Dear niece, I have gathered a selection of my cherished toys and books. Among them, my beloved Piggy. <laughs> I highly recommend the nursery rhymes. They are uh, they're charming as well as educational. So I'll take no offense should they put your little one straight to sleep. With all my affection, Auntie Arabella. Oh, wait. So I think Flo... No, no. So... Oh, this one! Hi, Piggy! Can I pick you up, Piggy? No? You don't want to come with me, Piggy? So sad. The Wolf Glove. Oh, this is... Okay, nursery rhyme. Oh, it's... Oh, it's featured. Okay, wait. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Time to continue on our journey. Alright. And I'm sorry for taking a little break here and there because I'm actually coming down with a flu and I have a runny now, so... If I'm being silenced, it's actually me trying to... <laughs> okay? Trying to take care of my runny nose. Oh yeah, and let's save. I forgot to do that just now. And let me read this one. Dear me, oh, for Florence, yeah, Elizabeth's daughter, our niece. Dear niece, I have gathered a selection of my cherished toys and books. Among them, my beloved piggy. I highly recommend the nursery rhymes. They're charming as well as educational. So, I'll take no offense should they put your little one straight to sleep. With all my affections, Auntie Arabella. Alright. Oh, oh! Is this the piggy? This is the piggy. This is the piggy that she wants to give to Florence. But why is it lying around in here, though? And yes, this manor has too much garden. Okay, for one manor. I just hope they don't have labyrinth in here. I can't get out. If if they have labyrinth, I think that is the end. Because I can't get in, I can't get out. Alright? Let's check this one. Oh, this is the nursery rhyme. And it features one of the flower that we were supposed to grow. The wolf glove. Hike on the mountain top so steep. Grows a flower that's hard to keep. Its petals delicate and bright, whistling in the wind with all their might. The mountainers who climb up hike, 
listen for the whistle as they try to find their way amidst the snow and reach the summit ticks aglow. Huh. Wait, so it's a mountainer. No. It's a flower that grows in the mountain, so it might be associated with cold and wind. Alright. Oh, wait. With every step they hear it loud, the wolf glows whole, clear, and proud. Guiding them through paths unknown to reach the summit and call it home. Wait, so wolf glove can produce sound? Is it like a real sound? Okay, this is where we will be growing the wolf glove, I think. And where should I go? Where sh Let me just take my seat, my lovely seat. There it is. Wolf glove, open up. Oh, even it's being kept in a garden shack. Okay, and it has so many things. Wait. Notes on soil additive. Sometimes I need to add extra nutrition to the soil. I have found the following amounts to work best with my different pots. Wow. 118, 112, 97. I think we're using 97. Right? So, soil additive 97, I think. Okay. And anything that I can take with me except the seed? No? Okay, come with me, seed. Collect seed. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's pixie tears. It's not the wolf glove. It's a different one. Yeah, wolf glove is this one. And we have to go to the orangery if we want to get the seed. Okay, wait. This is not orangery. Oh, that is an apple. So this is an apple injury. <laughs> Applery. And this is me. Riri. <laughs> Alright. Uh, where should... Wait, wait. Let me check around. Microscope slide. Okay. Specimen rat champion. Rat champion. And this one is... Oh, this is the fox glove. Okay, but what does that have to do with Moi? Open up. Open up. Can I place you inside? No? This one is Pixie Tears and the sketch. Oh no. I don't have biology degree and I don't even know my own biology. Bluebell, Cradle Fern, Spring Dance Shrub, Primrose, and this one is what? What are you? Hyashin, Haishin, Hyashin, Haishin. Can't say the name, I'm so sorry. And this is tincture of iodine. Perfect for preparing microscope slide. But what? Why do we need microscope? That is the question. Let me pick. Ah, ah, there is a sheep! There is a sheep! Hello, sheep! Sheep! Hello, sheep! That is sound the sheep. Oh my god, it's meet and greet with sound the sheep itself. It's looking at my way. Hello! <laughs> oh my god, that is so cute. C can we just, can we go there later on? I don't think we can. It looks pretty open. It, I don't think it's a part of my manner. Let me read this one. <laughs> In the world of plants, the sun is the ultimate source of energy. Chloroplast. Small organelles inside the cells of a plant are responsible for capturing the light from the sun and converting it into sugar through photosynthesis. However, not all plants have chloroplast. Some plants rely on organic matters for their energy and do not photosynthesize. They have lost their chloroplast over time and have instead Adapted to obtain energy by absorbing sugars through their roots. It is therefore recommended to add a certain amount of sugar to the soil when cultivating these particular plants. Oh, so this one, where is, where is, where is she? Pixie Tears doesn't have any chloroplasts. Okay, I will take that into mind. No, no chloroplasts. I don't know what that means, but I will keep that in mind. Okay, or chart mosaic. Okay. And so many things to read. Wait a moment. Priest, huh? Priest 
tools and illustrated history of England. Four scholars at fans' classes and the discerning reader. I'm not even one of them, but I'll try. Back in the Middle Age, during the reign of Queen Elizabeth, all Catholics were persecuted by law. See, therefore, some household built secret rooms in case they needed to hide a priest that was visiting their family home. Yeah, yeah, so it has, there is a trap door, there is a hidden door in the kitchen, but I don't know the year that I need to put to unlock the door. Many of these so-called priest holes were designed and built by Nicholas Owen. Only the owner of the house and Nicholas himself knew about the location. Because of this, it is thought that there may be many undiscovered priest holes throughout England to this day. Well, folks, we are about to discover the priest holes ourselves. Hopefully, because I still don't know what year that trapdoor in the kitchen has. Mm, letter from historian. Lady Arabella, thank you for inviting me to Botany Manor last Monday. As a historian, I found it wonderful to see an authentic medieval manor, especially one as beautiful as yours. I apologize again for not being able to locate the place. Huh? Wait, I apologize again for not being able to locate the priest hole in your house. A professor, a historian can, and I can. <laughs> I think it's time for me to apply for Harvard. I don't want to go to that college university that just sent us a letter. They are so harsh. I'm a female. I feel hurt, so I'm not going to apply there. <laughs> Although I'm convinced it exists and we will find it one day. It won't be easy. They tend to be hidden well and sometimes require elaborate mechanism to be open. Okay. Professor Pennyward. Well, Professor Pennyward, I will make your visit worth your time by discovering the priest hole myself. Hopefully. Alright, is there anything that I can take in here? No? Nothing? Okay, let me sit here before I read another letter. Mm-hmm. Enjoy the view, okay? Mm-hmm. Alright, let's continue on. What is this letter? Lady Arabella, I have received your request for repairs. To the roof of your garden tower. <laughs> Alice, I must confess that I am not the man to undertake this task. It may have escaped your notice that the tower in your orchard is known to locals as the Turbulent Tower. Oh no, I'm not ready for this. I'm not signing up for this. It is believed that a poltergeist dwells within its walls. Oh my gosh. Are we doing this right now? Are we doing this really, really right now? Legend says that the spirit is evil and brings ferocious winds upon anyone who dares enter the tower. I don't want to provoke the wrath of this ghost, and I advise you to refrain from meddling with the tower. Willie, the builder. I don't dare. I don't dare. Please don't. Please no. I don't dare. Where is the tower? Which tower that you were saying? Which tower? Is that the tower? Oh no, we're not going there. Also, actually, that looks like a real reenactment from Tangled, Rapunzel movie. But still, not going there. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, is there anything else that I can take a look at? Oh, wait, what? Is there another letter that I haven't read? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, wait. Dear Arabella, how are you getting on in your garden? I hope it's not getting to be too much for you on your own these days. Our mutual friend mentioned you have been struggling to germinate the ash bloom. Have you tried making sure there is a fresh compost in the pot? Stubborn seeds often need that to grow. 
I I already finished that. I'm so sorry. I'll visit you sometime, and perhaps I can find a way to crack the seat for you. I can show you the book I have been working on at the same time. Yours sincerely, Charles Tucker. Yeah, correct your typo first, Charles Tucker, and I will have to let you know that I solved the whole germinate problem myself. Thank you for the offer, though. I appreciate it, but my smart mind can take it. Alright, can I go here, please? I prefer to go in here. Open up. Yes. Oh, where am I? Okay, it, it looks very calming. I like this. I would prefer to be here instead of that turbulent tower, poltergeist power. What book this is? The Heritage Orchard. Preservation of Endangered Apple Varieties. Alright, sit here. Alright. And this is not an orangery. No? What is this? Huh? What? Wait, wait, wait. I can put a plant in here. And there are several apples to be put in here. Oh, sugar. Sugar, right? Sugar. Yeah, I have to make a sugar, right? Wait, cider apples. Can all be a rosé, dabney, foxwell, brown snout, pom... Puppet mast on pine, <laughs> cat's head, Kingston black, green sub, Lord Peckover, Seymour's delight, Peter Greenstick, Marlin's mist. Okay, okay, calm down, chill, chill. Let me check. C C cider macking. Okay, I need to. Oh, the Knobby Rase? I think it has like the biggest sugar. Yeah, sugar, tannins, and acid values given per single apple. Yeah, I think I need the Kenobi Rase. Wait, which one is Kenobi Rase? That one? Wait, do we have that one around? Laying around? Oh, you. You are. Wait, wait, wait. Calm down, calm down. I think I should bring my seat in here first before I do anything. Let me try to grab my plan, okay? What is my plan again? Is it Wolf Glove? I think it's not. Pixie Tears, yeah. Pixie Tears. We are about to make Pixie Tears out from apple sugar. Diabetes sugar. Wait, where's the... Where, where, where? Oh, there. Oh, where? Oh, there. <laughs> okay. Let me put the soil, yeah? And let me put you, Pixie Tears, here you go, and water. Alright. There you are, Pixie Tears. Alright, let me bring you to meet your friend. Wait, is this the way? Yeah? Oh, apparently I can just walk through here instead of walking all the way. Alright, Pixie Tears, let me make sure that you grow really well. With all this sugar. This is like a human being growing with sugar. This is like a human being in this day and age. Growing with sugar. Alright, let me press this one, I think. This apple. Okay, let me press you. Hopefully, I can make this work. Okay, let me put that over there. Okay, pressing. Okay, do you like that, Pixie Tears? Do you like that? Will you grow now? What? Not yet. Do I have to add more? What What else do I need to add more? Mm. 35. Kingston Black. How do a Kingston Black look like? Not black. Yeah, shouldn't be surprised. I think this is a Kingston Black. Are you Kingston Black? Yeah, you are a Kingston Black. Let me try putting you there. Okay, let me try pressing that. Okay, do you like that? Is that suitable for your taste, Pixie Tears? No? It's not? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I need more clues. Maybe I need more clues to figure out how that will work. 
That means I have to go to the other way near the turbulent tower, I think. All right, let's go there slowly, but surely. <sighs> if there is any poltergeist, I'm ending the I'm ending the video. Okay, I'm ending the video. Now we will pretend that we do not. The door is open. The door is open. The door is open, but that doesn't mean that. Another pot? Hello? I'm not ready for another pot. Wait, it's open. Excuse me? Anything that I can inspect? Let me inspect. Oh, this is for the fox glove, I think. The Mountaineer's Guide to Alpine Exploration. Be sure to wear the correct gear when climbing. The winds in the Alps can be fierce and changeable. It is advised to wear thick, warm clothing and sturdy boots with a good grip. Ah, I see. I think we need to reenact that one. Oh, we we'll have to use the tower to grow fox glove. I think. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wind speed of thirty five on third floor. Wind speed of fifty on second. Forty five twenty. Somehow my an animal matter broke. I hope there isn't a poltergeist in the tower after all. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. All right. Fine. Fine. I I'll see what I can. Oh, it's broken. Oh, I can't go down. Oh, alright, let me just um, open this one so that it is connected to this part of the house. And... Oh, wait. Painting room? Lady Arabella, as you can see the staircase of the orangery collapse in your absence. <laughs> I have already written to the builder in the hope he wants to sort it out. So, as you know, he can be difficult to pin down. I do apologize if this is getting in the way of your research. I don't suppose you could find another way into the bottom level. Okay, this is the key to the painting room. I'll take that. And what is this that we have here? Wait, what is that gold stamp? From Matty Golding. Okay, is this the letter? Oh, dearest Arabella, we made it to the Alps. We are so sad that you couldn't join us this time, but we understand you are busy creating your herbarium. Yesterday, we were lost on a hike until suddenly we heard a strange whistling tune. We followed the sound and soon enough, we discovered it was coming from a tiny flower. Oh yeah, this is another lore about fox glove. But nothing tell us about pixie tears so far. If only you had been there to tell us what kind of flower it was. Your loving friend always, Natty. Natty, I think next time please don't use goat stem. Okay, I have paranoid. I have paranoid with goat, alright? And yeah, wait, wait. I don't think we can do anything else around here. Let me check the painting room then. Let me see what I can do inside. Knock knock. Open up. Okay. Oh, <laughs> It's looking really nice. Meadow Orchid. <sighs> orchard? Orchid, right? Orchard Orchid. I think this is leading us to the Pixie Tears problem. Your research proposal on the structure of coastal plan was of quaint interest. Huh? Oh, we have no plans to fund a small project like this. But perhaps if you were set on botanical fieldwork, you might assist Professor Montague in his work on British Meadow Orchids. Uh, this is a much more wholesome letter than the college Rejection letter, yeah. I would say acceptance, but then she is not being accepted. She's being rejected harshly. I'm sure your natural aptitude for domestic duties would be much appreciated. 
Might I also recommend John Linley's book, Ladies Botany, or a familiar introduction to the study of the natural system of botany? Oh no, it is still... Is it still... Oh my god, is it still an ins insult? It is an elementary book for unscientific readers, and one I have heard is a suitable amusement for ladies such as yourself. Being about a mother who wishes to teach her children about plants. I mean, we don't have children. Why does he come to that conclusion? Honestly. Okay, flower painting in watercolor. Alright, and this one... Symbology? Alright? Oh, oh, okay. Wait, wait. Yeah, Star and Crescent, it's Islam, I know. Three Scallion Neolithic? Okay. Tai Yi Tu Taoism. Is that Yin and Yang? Is that a different symbol? Wheel of Dharma, Buddhism, Star of David, Judaism. And that is Catholicism, yeah, Agnus Dei. Ik Onkar, Sikhism, and Om Hinduism. Okay. But what does that have to do with the symbol? I mean, we already deduced that it has a trapdoor inside. But I don't know how to open that one. Okay, this is the manor floor plan. Let me take a look. We are in ground floor right now. And... There is a kitchen, it's on the lower floor, library on the second floor. Oh, we, we haven't even reached our bedroom just yet, yeah? It's on the first floor, but we don't have any access to the bedroom as well. Oh yeah, because the tree, I think, is blocking the way. Alright, and what is this? Mm -hmm. Botanical painting. Alright, wait. I just realized that there is this one. Lady Arabella, I was wondering if I could join Mr. Banay into town later this afternoon to place an order for a new kitchen skill. Yeah, the skill. Oh yeah, that's how you say it. The skill. Yeah, we need to put like an exact wake on the skill to be able to open the trapdoor, the priest hole that we find. The one we have is rather ancient, and I'm afraid it's not suitable for measuring floor to make my delicious scones. Mm-hmm. If you could let me know your decision before the afternoon, that would be lovely. In your service, Mrs. Patterson. Oh, Hazel, you just want to have some time, some dating time with your Mr. Banay? Mm-hmm. Wait, what? Who is this from? This is a love letter, I think. My dearest Arabella, in Garden's Fair, you grace the scene of flower rare. Your presence beams with radiant light. Wait, this is a really amazing poem. A lily's charm so pure and white. <laughs> Your hands like petals soft and fine. In tender touch, a love divine. And in your eyes, a brilliance glows as daisies fair in spring's repose. Oh, okay. I will not going to continue on that. That is quite a precious confession. I'm not going to read that because I'm afraid I might cross that. Okay, can I touch the watering can? No. Alright, so let me check because I'm still confused. We found the... no, cider apples, I think. And... Wait, wait. What notes? Is that... useful? I don't think so. Microscope slides, chloroplast book, and then... Is there anything else? Apple blending... Envelope... No, that is not. I think that's actually... yeah, close to this one. Nursery rhyme. Letter from Wilder, and then Alpine Weather, Wind Research, Envelope with Stamp, Letter about Alps. Now the question is, this both notes? No. This is not... Okay, what about this one? Pot note. Oh yeah! But how do I make that? 
wait, wait, wait. Spot notes. Let me get back to the pot notes, okay? Let me get back to the pot notes. We are going to make that pixie tears crying. Or else we are going to cry because we don't know how to grow the pixie tears. I hope not. Let's finish that. Okay, where's that? Pot note, I think it's over there. Excuse me, oh my god, trees, you are blocking my way. Coming through, let me check, let me check. Mm hmm excuse me. 97, oh, 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 okay, I have to count, okay, okay. I have to press them at the same time so that I get the same exact amount of sugar. For pixie tears to be able to grow, I think. I think. Let's try, let's try. 97. 97. Which one that I can add to make up 97? 40. Wait, wait, wait. This is tricky. 40. Okay, 40 and... Hmm. Ha! Ah. Wait, wait, wait. 40 and 27, that makes 67, 67 and 30. Oh, yeah. Kenobi Rase, Kenobi Rase, Cat's Hat, and Merlin's, Merlin's, Merlin's Mist. Okay. Kenobi Rase, yeah, that's this one. Kenobi Rase, let me pick you up. Mm hmm. You better grow after this, Pixie Tears. I'm trying my best, okay? And the next one is Marlin's Mist. Okay, this one. The blue one. And what is the other one? I forgot. Let me take a look at the list again. Okay. This one. Cat's hat. Cat's hat. Which one is a cat's hat? Oh, the green one. Which, which green? That looks like an apple straight out from Snow White. Poison apple that makes Snow White sleep. And skip school and skip life. Okay, this better work. Let's try. Okay, 97. Mm hmm. Grow, please. No? Ah, it's growing. Alright, there it is. Our plan. Oh, oh, there are butterfly coming. Oh my god, that is so cute. Okay, let me open my herbarium. Pixie. Tears. Yeah. The pixie tears no longer contain chloroplasts, which are organelles responsible for photosynthesis. Instead, the pixie tears obtain sugars through their roots, which it commonly finds in the apples from orchard. I see. Okay. <laughs> oh, I understand now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it grows using the sugar from apple. That's why it's often fine in it's often found in the orchard. I see. Alright, but I think I think this is actually the perfect time to end this video right here. We will go on yeah, on growing fox glove. Oh, wolf glove. I'm so sorry. It's wolf glove. Yeah, we will hold on on Making this one because I think this game has, wait, five chapters. Yeah, five chapters. So I want to make sure that we do like half of this chapter in this video. And hopefully we can do the half of the other chapters in the next video. So should we end just here or wait, let me just sit. Let me just sit. Let me just sit here and we will talk while I'm sitting here. All right. Here we are, let's talk about my experience with this game and how I feel about this game. Well, first and foremost, I think that this game needs to have a change in their title. I think they need to change their title of the game name, the game title. Change it from Botany Manor to Beautiful Manor because honestly, this game has beautiful graphic, beautiful manor design, beautiful garden design, beautiful art of the flower as well. Oh, let me just show you. My favorite, okay, is after we finish discovering, like, growing the flower, we have this 
we have the art of the flower in our book oh my god i love that and whoever make that art that art is so amazing this flower art is really amazing it's so precious for me and wait let me sit back again <laughs> okay and this game oh my god they have a very amazing delivery in delivering what I would say, calming, relaxing ambience. They have this very calm atmosphere around. I mean, just look at me. Just, just look at how I go through this game. How many jokes, how many things that I roast in this game. I don't think I roast that much. I don't think I make so many jokes in that playthrough just now. Because, well, the whole game, the whole atmosphere, it actually lulls me. It actually turns me into this calm, serious, studying person because I'm always like, Oh, this puzzle? Oh, this text? Okay, what does this mean? What can I do with this text? How can this text help me in growing my plan? Oh, why is this? Hmm, a flask? What can I do with this flask? How can this flask make me grow my plan so yeah this whole game <laughs> actually makes me a very calm and serious person but yes this has a very calming and relaxing atmosphere okay and i am also not able to affect the ambience i'm also enjoying the calming the relaxing experience that this game gives while also solving puzzles are here and there okay and well actually i think the first and foremost thing that i should mention is how they put the duck and the achievement with the duck in this game i love duck so of course this game already going to oh my god make me fall in love more when i discover that they have duck in this game and an achievement with the involved duck i love it thank you thank you so much for inserting a duck in this game although i don't think it has any function at all i think it's just there for the quack quack achievement and that's all and well i think this game is also very educational for me learning about plants like this is the first time i learned that oh there is a plant that can grow during thunderstorm that is news to me like, oh, there is plant that doesn't have a chloroplast inside them. So they're actually just drinking sugar, just consuming diabetes from other plants. That is also the first time I learned about that. So for me, it's a very educational experience. And once again, I'm really, really grateful. I'm so thankful for Balloon Studios and White Thorn Games, thank you so much for the opportunity once again. You have a very good game and I'm wishing Botany Manor a very good release day. Oh, it's going to release soon. I hope you guys will play this game as well and you guys can experience this relaxing and calming experience yourself. Oh, and one more thing, one more thing. Just before I end this video. I love the way they presented their lore. I love lore. So to be able to learn a little bit about Arabelle's past, Arabelle's family, well, the background of my main character mostly, is rewarding for me. And also discovering like a little bit of information about the people living in this manner, like Hazel and Bennett, they have like this romantic relationship. Or even just a small thing like Jimmy breaking the mortar. It's very, very rewarding for me. It's like, oh my god, they have this kind of relationship. Oh, they have this kind of event happening in the house. For me, it is very rewarding. Okay, it feels like I just discovered the hottest gossip. The hottest tea of all time. <laughs> but yes, alright, I think that's it for this video. As usual, thank you so much if you have watched until this point. I really, really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed my video, my experience about this game. And if you are curious and want to try Botany Manor for yourself, I have put the link in my description so you guys can go there and just click on the link to take you to where Botany Manor is. Well, there's Team Page, not like the real manor, okay? I would like to visit this manor in real life, of course. Minus the Turbulence Tower, yes. 
minus that Rapunzel Tower. Where is that tower? I should be able to see it from here. No, I can't. Okay, I can. But yes, alright, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like and yeah, please leave a comment about what you think about this game or maybe you have played this game and want to share your opinion, experience about this game. Feel free to do so in the comment section down below, okay? I will really, really appreciate it. And if you are new to this channel and you find me and you like watching me play through all of this game, don't forget to subscribe to me so you will be notified every time I upload new videos. But alright, I think that's it for our experience in Botany Manor right now. We will continue this in our next video. I'll see you in our next video. Goodbye! Otsuri, bye! Botany Manor. Alright, get out of my manor, guys. Time's over. Okay, visiting hours is over. Time for me to enjoy this manor for myself. Alright?